Competed in a dog sled race, an aerospace engineer from Poway has a chance to do just that. Once a year, Fall Rev and Polar takes 20 people from around the world with no experience and lets them race across Norway in a three-day event. Tabitha Lipkin has this once-in-a-lifetime opportunity. I'm going to freeze my buns off. Rose Sandler, an adventurer who spends her time racing horses across exotic lands, now prepares to take on a new challenge. Who takes 20 people a year, amateurs, who've never dog sledded, gives them the gear, teaches them to dog sled, and then sets us all loose for a three-day, 186-mile I did a ride style dog sled race. Say that fast three times. Though Sandler has never raced dogs, she has a background and sense of spirit for this once in a lifetime trip, having already competed in two adventure races on horseback through Mongolia and South Africa. And I ended up doing the Mongol Derby in 2014, which is a thousand, a thousand kilometers, so 650 mile horse race across outer Mongolia. In 2016, I was in South Africa for the inaugural running of Race the Wild Coast, which was three horses over 250 miles of the wild coast of South Africa. Right. Completely different. I have not been to the Arctic. I mean, I've so snowboarded and I've camped in the winter, but a full on expedition, building snow walls and having a team of dogs and camping in the Arctic is gonna be completely new. Only two racers from North America will find themselves in Norway, one by selection, one based on popular vote. Right now, Sandler needs about 6,000 votes to push to the top, so she has partnered with a local reading organization that helps kids read and informs others about her campaign. For every vote this week that comes in, I'm donating money to Traveling Stories. 25 cents a vote to be exact. The voting ends December 14th. The announcement will be the next day. To see Sandler's campaign, you can go to fox5sandiego.com and click on the Scene on tab. Tabitha Lipkin, Fox 5 Sports. Looks like quite a